early kills. That's right. And just nailing that off stage. And just Peach has so many strengths. And then seeing two of them work together in teams. And Slayers and Sam Sora actually used to do doubles in Smash 4 as well. They did. They yeah. did. They doubled so, a few times. That's right. Yeah. Scary, scary business, man. I'm really excited to see what the future of that is going to bring for those two gentlemen there. But before we talk about that, we got to talk about this man. I don't even know if this is a man. Is this a young man or is this a, it's a grown man? It's a, I don't know what's going on, okay? But <laughs> we got to talk about this person right now sitting down onto the main stage here on Twitch.tv 2GD Gaming. That is Zachary, ladies and gentlemen, doing mm -hmm. phenomenal work with that wolf. Oh, yes. Uh, I think there's no argument when we talk about Vest Wolf. It, it, yeah. It's kind of... Oh, yeah, there's a lot of, there's a lot of names tossed in the hat, but I think at the end of the day... We got to stop playing with ourselves. We know that Zachary is the business, okay? We've seen what he's been doing over there in Japan, and he didn't come over here for no reason. He traveled a very, very long way to do the damn thing, and he's definitely going to do it here. Yeah, and I believe he's uh, seated very high, which is, you know, very expected here. Zachary is fourth seed at this tournament. Yes, that's right. I interviewed him yesterday. He was telling me how comfortable he was feeling about this event. He knows, obviously, people have a certain perception of Wolf in their head about what this character can and can't do. And honestly, he came all the way over here just to kind of mix things up. And that's one thing that, you know, people from across the sea are really good at. You know, we have our set characters. We have our Ikes. We have yes. our Peaches. Yep. We have, you know, whatever. But, you know, you get very unconventional matchups, very unconventional play styles across the ocean. And when they bring that over here, man, it really makes us uncomfortable. And we've seen, we seen what uh, Gluttony's been doing. We've seen what a lot of players from Europe obviously have been doing as well. And then, of course, Zachary is certainly going to follow the script here. So I'm really excited to see what we're going to get here in this game. Oh, yeah. And we've seen him do so many things with Wolf. One thing I really want to point out is sure. Wolf's biggest weakness is his recovery, right? Yeah, I mean, every, Everything else he, he just does so well at, but free, free, free. not, like, he's like the only Spacey that just, it, it, he can't side B and then up B, you know, yes, you got to yes, pick yes. one, and his side B does not snap onto the ledge, you got to kind of sweet spot it, yes. but we, every time I see Zachary recover, I'm just like, dang, he actually got back. He actually did. You know what's crazy is that a lot of times, People get so wrapped up into dealing with Zachary on stage that they forget that I, I can actually gimp this guy. And that's a lot of what happens, man. Oh, you know, yeah. you just you fear him so much on stage. I'm like, all right, man. Well, he's going to be able to come back because I can't even defeat him on this part of the game. So, uh, you know, Zachary, well, we got a chance to see him play yesterday. I mean, just whether that means he was using Blaster to kind of, you know, just dictate how the pacing of the match was going to go or whether he was smothering the opponent with buttons, you know, short hop near to oh. just about anything that Wolf wants Neutral to do. Neutral air is uh, humongous. Yes. It is. But, I mean, well, it's humongous. It's also kind of busted, too. Like, yo, what is this move? But, I mean, he just had all his bases covered. I'm like, what can't this person do? This person can do anything. Kill kill you at 40 with that tipper down smash at the edge. He sets up so many tech chase situations. Oh, by the way, we got the damage output, too. Yes, the only yes. spacey with a kill throw. That's he true. has a kill throw. The back throw is ridiculous. And he also combos off of up throw as well. Mm -hmm. So I, I've just seen Wolves do like 50 damage off of a throw or a sour nair. And then he also sets up a lot of tech chase situations. And he can just nail the kill. And his yeah. smash attacks, incredibly low cooldown. Yes, absolutely. I mean, I can't count how many times I've been playing online. Wolf does a smash attack once. I run and try to punish. He runs out, comes back and does another smash attack. Just yeah. completely outspaced me, man. Yeah, it's, it's incredible. Wolf is an incredible character, and it really makes me happy that we see these characters that were missing in Smash 4 from Brawl come back into Ultimate oh, yeah. and do very well. See, at first I thought it was a matter of, all right, the majority of the Smash Ultimate community is a big part of Smash 4 community. Maybe not so much Brawl players as much anymore. Maybe it's matchup unfamiliarity. You know, some of these guys don't know how to fight Snake. Some of these guys don't know how to fight Wolf, so on and so forth. But then I was like, wait a second. I think the people piloting them are just that damn fantastic. Oh, yeah. It's the characters. It's the players. It's everything, man. Phenomenal stuff. And even... More phenomenal gameplay getting ready to come go down, excuse me, right here. Zach Ray ready to face off against Silent Rain. Uh, yes, a Mario main from California. Nice, nice, nice. So we're going to see a clash of metas. And like you said, you mm -hmm. know, Genesis is that mixing pot. We get mm -hmm. to see all these different regions and all their different metas mm -hmm. clash together. So let's see what Zachary can do here. He is fourth seed. So we'll see what he can do and how to push this Mario. Yes, he's, oh, God. I mean, he is doing a phenomenal job pushing this Mario clear into the blast zone. Oh, dang. God. All right. Dang. Well, Dang, Zach, I mean, Zachary, I, you didn't have to do it that quick, man. Yeah, right. He got sped ran, but it's speed ran. But, you know, it it happens, you know. And that's what happens, you know, when you play against a wolf, especially a wolf, you know, with somebody like Zachary's playing him. He has a phenomenal job at obviously putting on a lot of damage and just not stopping the bleeding anytime soon. And I didn't really see. Oh, my Ooh, God. All right. It don't even matter at that point. Now, I will say that one advantage that Silent Rain does have with Mario is the combo factor. Mario does a phenomenal job at comboing most characters in the cast, especially characters like Fox. Wolf, Falco, you know, you name it. Those characters have kind of fast fall a little bit. 
<laughs> he could do a phenomenal job, but he might not ever get the chance here, Korean. Yeah, and th th these up smashes out of shield are doing phenomenal work here for Zachary. And it, it's very interesting because Zachary is from Japan. Japan is definitely known for being a little bit more of a reserved region, but I see Zachary like always going in, trying to get those side B conversions off of the fair as yes, well. Sir. He goes in with this character, and this character can just Ooh. do so much on the offense. I got to ask you, is there really ever a such thing as reserved with Wolf. I mean, yes, there are, I guess, points and times where, you know, he might get a little blast heavy, but for the most part, though, if you're comfortable in the matchup and you know the damage output that Wolf brings to the table, oh, if yeah. you can go ham, just go ham, man. Oh, exactly. This character, the damage output on this character is so immense. The kill power on oh. this character is so immense. Just the general offense, like you were saying, is crazy for this character, and he also has that blaster to fall back on, too. He, he kind of, like, just overall just really, really well-rounded. Well yes, absolutely. You know, has a few faults in a few areas, but you know, it definitely makes up with that damage output, like you said. And as you see right here, not going for the down smash on the ledge like we see he does with most characters. Down smash, really awesome sweeping tool. That time, I actually wanted to play safe and just toss off forward. So just in case Silent Rain yeah. wanted to do neutral, get up off the ledge. Nice. Gets the nair. Okay, okay. going to up B. And then, okay, but good nair from Silent Rain. And oh, wait. No back, though? Interesting. Yeah. Really good parry from Zach right here. Oh, another parry into the up tilt, but he got the back hit. Not going to close out the stock there. Ooh, up smash. Not going to connect here, but Silent Rain has a chance. Here's the combo game, but it's going to get uh, matched up by the Nair. Mm -hmm. Silent Rain finds himself back off stage once more. Really struggling to get back on. Man, just the fact, just the presence of mind that Zach is bringing on the legend stage is enough to mix up Silent Rain. He hasn't even pressed a button yet. Oh, man, and that forward tilt is so good. If you angle it downward as well, you can hit below the ledge, and we see Zachary always going for that. Mm -hmm. And it's almost like a sword because those claws are the hitbox, and the Nair oh. is going to seal it out. I feel like of all the moves that should hurt when you get hit by Wolf, definitely, you know, forward tilt and definitely Nair. I mean, we've all seen the space animals boots, but fam, those boots got claws <laughs> on the toes. Like, look, come on, man. <laughs> like, you get Nair'd by that, you, you were definitely asking for it. Oh, yeah, and I mean, even if, if you take all the spaces and take them off the... Take him out of spaceships. Yeah. I, I think Wolf's gonna beat him up, man. Yeah, right? oh, just, just, easy. Just look at him. Free, free, <laughs> he's, free. he's rugged. <laughs> yeah, I definitely would not want to meet Wolf in the back alley. That's for sure, man. I would definitely not want to meet him. And I love the claw animations they added on the Wolf. Like, mm -hmm. I, I definitely do like the brawl design, but yeah. this design in Ultimate is just so cool. It almost gives like that Wolverine feel. Yes, yes, yes. That Logan feel. I, I gotta say, his design in brawl was cool, but it was kind of a little, little jagged you know in, in a couple areas right, and right. from what i read it was because that they added wolf in last second that his animations kind of suffered he was kind of he looked a little bit wonkier like it, it's um most specifically speaking about like his short hop nair or like his jab animation it just really looked kind of unorthodox yeah it looked weird <laughs> it definitely looked weird phenomenal character in brawl obviously much better here but they definitely could have did a little bit better on the animations but you know what though they had quite a bit of time from brawl to now to make yeah. them look pretty and damn it they did a phenomenal job yeah and as a star fox fan it really it just feels like more of that wolf attitude you know just just the whole character design just feels so much more like wolf but we're gonna right. go here into game number two town and city is the counter pick that's right man now Phenomenal start for the Zachary in game number one. I feel like, you know, even as phenomenal as Wolf is, Silent Rain's Mario, certainly not to be slept on either. And Mario definitely brings a lot of options to the table when it comes to comboing Wolf. It's just going to be a matter of if he can get his hands on. He does, he's doing a really good job, though, of finding an access point with that short hop Nair. I wonder if he can get more off of it Will things kind of spell out a little differently for him. Ooh, the platform moving kind of messed up Silent Rain's combo there. But actually, I mean, this game doing a phenomenal job, yes. kind of going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. And like you said, using that Mario air drift to drift in and out, try to get out of range of these blasters and these nares. Yes, that's right. See, there it is. They'll do, safe. The, they'll do one for <laughs> Right, safe. He's <laughs> the umpire. That's the umpire first oh, match. Safe. And, and what's so great, too, with the dash mechanic, you can, like, dash back forward smash mm -hmm. is such a great option in this game. But the up smash out of shield, and we've seen Zachary really abuse that. And I feel like a lot of the top tier characters in this game, mm -hmm. a lot of them can work out of shield, which not all characters can do. That's right. That's certainly a luxury not known to many, that's for sure. I like the upper right off the ledge, so he's getting really tired of the, the ledge pressure here from Zach Ray. But man, every time he comes, every time he has a linear approach to parry there, it's it's every time. It's he's got to mix it up just a little bit more. Yeah, gotta cut gotta throw in those empty lands and wait a minute. Okay, there's the flood. I like oh. the Almanu with the flood. Gets oh. the stage tech. You have got to do it. Yeah, and that reversal is gonna mess him up there. No double jump for Silent Rain and Zachary sitting at three stocks and it, it's looking so hopeless here for Rain. It's just going to be so hard to seal out this stock. Every time he comes in, Zachary it just feels like he has the parry on deck for these aerial approaches. That's right. He's going to have to mix it up again. I don't blame Silent Rain for the approaches that he's making. Typically, short hop Nair, wonderful combo starter for Mario mm. and then of course back air high percent can either be enough to kill you or if not, at least knock you off stage and history shows you get Wolf off stage. Things aren't going to be looking pretty for him but it's all about how you decide to approach yes. and he's just a little bit too telegraphed. Okay, but okay. he's starting to cook up a little bit here. 
Yeah, he's starting to get these up air combos here, getting Zachary up in that air position, and just gotta even like getting the grab. All that started off with the grab. He didn't really have to necessarily rely on that. Oh, for it. <gasps> There's the flood. Oh, wow. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He said, I gotta clean you up, sir. <laughs> And that is a mix-up that Zachary doesn't do too often. And it is good, though. The up B and disadvantage is a great hitbox. But right there, the flood was the perfect answer. Hey, Korean, how could I forget about the cape that Mario possesses? Yes. There's, now, I think Zachary's a little bit more... A little bit more up to date on when he wants to use his neutral <laughs> special because he's yeah. like, "Yo, man, I, I can't, I can't just toss it out willy nilly anymore." Yep. And you know, a lot of people say how good the blasters. Ooh, and the nair gonna stick him out there. But it, there's a lot of characters with reflectors. Silent Rain gonna get back on stage here. Oh, and then again, trying to catch another neutral get up. His ledge pressure is so phenomenal. Good ooh. stuff. Gets the parry right into the dash attack. Up air. Okay. Oh, wait a second. The back air not gonna connect. The but the nasty neutral are gonna come in for Zachary. And Zachary looking for this back kill. Throw. No fourth throw that time. Okay, yep. maybe back throw's not quite enough. Uh, to KO quite yet. Oh, look at the pace. Oh, man, that up smash almost connect, but the boot is going to seal it out for Zachary. That dash, man, what what move on Wolf doesn't kill at this point, man? I, right. I just feel like 70 to 80% of his moveset, like, kills. It's right. such a good character. Yes. And when, when you're playing Wolf, I feel like one thing that's, like, a very common thing in this game, right? You're in that last stock, last hit situation. It's down to the wire. Mm -hmm. But Wolf, the, I just feel like he doesn't really have to worry because he got the blaster in neutral. You don't really have to commit. And then there's these... There's so much of these safe kill moves you can throw out on block, and it's just like you—you you just feel like you don't really have to commit for a kill. No, it can, you don't. It'll—it'll it'll slowly come. And you're